Hi, I'm Bryn Jones, I'm 19 years old and I'm competing in the New Zealand Rally Championship in my Ford Fiesta ST. Yeah! Right, All right, Bryn Jones, tell us a bit how you got involved in motorsport. Um, my father started back in 2009, um, just doing club events and that, and I basically just, just joined along with the ride really, just to come and have a look. I've always had an interest in with anything with a motor. Um, when I was about five, I was in, uh, quite interested in motocross. When I turned 12, I instantly wanted to go rallying. That was so. I managed to get, um, my father had a Mark 1 Escort from the shed and I did plenty of club events like hill climbs, autocrosses and motor cars. Basically everything I do is motorsport related. Um, so, okay, yeah, even when I'm not rallying, okay, I'm probably working, but um, yeah, I'm still doing things like watching a lot of YouTube of in-cars, of WRC, playing a lot of simulator or just even just working on the rally car, really. Um, I do occasionally catch up with mates and that. Yeah, it's mainly rallying for me. <laughs> <laughs> Give us a brief rundown of what rallies you've done and your experience within the, the NZRC. Um, my first ever rally I did was uh, Rally Coromandel 2018. It was, you know, to be able to go and do your first rally is an absolute blessing. You know, it's just, you get in the car, you're absolutely nervous and that. And <laughs> boy, oh boy, and you get to, I remember getting to the end of that last day, just going, yes, you know, sort of thing. And, yeah, um, ever since then we competed in four, um, four or five rallies. Uh, we did Raglan Rally of the Coast, uh, then we did Coromandel again in 2019, um, Rally Waitomo, and then, yeah, then last year we did uh, Rally of the Bay and uh, Rally Auckland. Plans for, for 2021, obviously you're in for the championship. Um, it's just this year's just to gain some experience of the NZRC. This is my first year, so we've just really got to take rally by rally and just see let, let the result come to us rather than we start chasing the results. Because um, yeah, if we go off in the first round or something stupid, then yeah, that's practically the year stuff for us. Um, new co-driver for this year as well, Brianna Little, who's um, you know, had had a pretty good run through the back half yeah. of last year, especially. Fantastic to have her on board because um, you know she's co joined for the likes of Chris West, um, the Matt Summerfield, and especially Shane Van Gisbergen last year. And yeah, to have that experience come on board and yeah, it's, it's absolutely awesome. It's obviously a, one of the strongest fields we've seen for a long time in this class. Yep. How do you sort of see it playing out, and where do you see yourself in that mix? Um, I'd like to see myself on the podium. Like we all know, Dylan's going to be dominant. Um, Jordan and Jackson, they're going to be, they're going to be quick, I reckon. Um, Harry, I think he'll take some time to adjust to his new R2 from going from the Starlet. But yeah, I don't see why, why he can't be up there as well. What's your knowledge of uh, Otago and uh, Dunedin? Very fast, very fast, and crusty. Need big balls. <laughs> Have you packed them? <laughs> it's a tight squeeze. <laughs> Jeez, I don't know if we can put that one. <laughs> <laughs>